Okay, I didn't see what characters they picked. Did they go into Fountain? Oh, okay, he's just, he's just starting with Falcon this time. Okay, yeah, Falcon Samus. He's just, he's he's trying to not put his through to uh, four Sheik Samus sets, you know. Uh, good on, good on Bandicoot. Our boy, our boy. All right, all right. So I haven't seen Ouch play, but I've heard he's pretty pretty solid, pretty solid player. Um, we can see <laughs> doesn't quite doesn't quite connect the name. Okay. Uh, good recovery. Yeah, you got to be careful, especially when you're recovering high out there like that, because I mean Samus can get under you and Shark, so he's definitely being cautious of that. Or Falcon could get out under you and uh, Shark Samus. Okay, yeah. Get, manages to get over the up tilt. Uh, just connecting a bunch of moves. She's kind of rough to, to get out of that spot, I guess. As Samus. Alright, alright. He just get off of me with the back air. Ooh, goes for the, goes for the knee, kind of hoping he's just going to fall there. Okay, okay. Threads the needle to get back. Another falcon kick. Mm, yep, over 100 get up. Wasn't, wasn't paying, wasn't paying attention. Ooh, okay. Gets back because he blocks the charge shot. Um, so fair, fair use of the charge shot, I guess. Ooh, just charges the <laughs> charges the down smash. Okay, okay. Yeah, Samus is a rough, rough character. You got to call out so hard to get the grab, and uh, if you uh, if you miss, you can just die. And if you get it, it, honestly, you don't get that much. But you 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 have to use it because if you don't, your opponent's just shield against you all all day. So it's just, her life's just kind of unfortunate like that. Okay. This is a really interesting stage now that I think about it that they started here. I mean, you know, obviously Falcons don't like this stage um, for good reason. The platforms don't look like they've been too brutal um, for Bandicoot so far, but they definitely can be low enough that they're very frustrating to deal with. Okay, okay. Oh, he calls him out. Nice. If I can get this camera flipped. Okay. That is the correct orientation. Alright, so yeah, yeah. I mean, si similar as uh, the last set we saw. Uh, logic here, you don't want to die early as Sam as Falcon can definitely make that happen. So instead, here, you're just like letting yourself both live forever, and your goal is to. Uh, just Gimp Sam or Gimp Falcon, which is a lot easier. I mean, which is a bit harder to do because it's harder to get them off stage here. But the blast zones really keep you from dying early, just getting called out by knee. You get access to Samus, is uh, one of her big advantages. Um, again, which is living forever. Oh, a nice movement. Gets the up air. Shark Sam is coming back. All right, nice, nice tech. Uh, let's 
still alive. Still has air. I didn't. I didn't realize. <laughs> yeah, down tilt distance too high at 145. Yeah, see now that you're in this kind of like high percent range, like Falcon doesn't get the nice like uh, the quick the quick confirms in the kill. Um, so it's a, little, it's a lot harder. He's got to kind of call Samus out. That's really what Samus wants. Because that takes away, like, one of Falcon's biggest advantages in the matchup, which is, like, being able to kill Samus a lot earlier than some of their characters can. Like, getting real confirms. Because, like, you know, a lot of characters confirm into kill with, like, throw, but Samus is so heavy, a lot of the kill throws, like, don't really work on her. But Falcon, you know, gets to just combo in with moves, and his moves don't care that she's heavy. And it's just like, okay, yeah. Okay, oh no. Just, just barely out of range. Well, let's see, it's, it's a hard comeback with Samus, especially on a stage as big as Dreamland. But, I mean, if he can find if he can find some gimps, it's not impossible for sure. Okay, um, dropping missiles, playing more missiles. That's probably good. Uh, you gotta kinda cut, uh, cut off Falcon's access to the whole stage. We, we saw earlier that uh, Bandicoot definitely Definitely comfortable with all this space, willing to like, kind of run around and, and use it to his advantage. Oh no, he gets pineapple! No, 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 no! Going back to fountain. All right, good call. I think that's a good call. This is probably the stage I would go to if if I ha if I hadn't gone here yet, Samus, or if I hadn't won here yet. Good stage, kind of cuts off. Um, like we saw earlier, um, Bandicoot really good at using the, um, the really good at using the space to his advantage. So kind of cutting off the space and making him have like making it more difficult to access some of those, like uh, kill confirm moves, like. Um, like Nair or Bear under like some of the platforms at certain heights. Like yeah, he has other stuff. He has Stomp, but like at higher percents, you might need you might need Nair or you know or, like scoop up air to to really confirm some of those kills. Uh, so like taking access away is really nice. Also like we've definitely seen that he rarely ever has been grabbing. So forcing him to play a more grounded game under the. Out of the platform seems to be like outside of his comfort zone, at least in this matchup. All right, yeah, kind of trying to shark below Samus, but he gets down with the with the nair. <laughs> he just gets kind of his arm just like sticks through, and he he just gets hit. Okay, some pressure on the shield. Mm, yeah, he tries to call him out for a drifting in, but Vandekweef just drift, drifts back and grabs the ledge off of the up B. Yeah, it's hard to kind of cover that. Um, from my understanding, if you can, it's hard because Samus is slow. She has a slow jump, and double jumping is really committal because she's so slow to fall and, and drift. But it's nice if you can um, intercept him at the, like, the apex of the up B. Um, before he starts getting all his nice drift mix-ups, like, at the end of it. Because, like, once he's at the apex, he's he's been committed to a while for his angle, so you've had a chance to, like, react to it. But he hasn't, like, gotten to choose his, like, fall drift, you know. Ooh, the get-up attack beats the down smash. Funny. Okay. Four throw. Oh, yeah, doesn't quite get the up air. I was doing much better this set, or this game. Um, really take, uh, taking control of the space a lot better in, under, um, on Fountain. Okay. Get the dash attack. 
Quick dash back, trying to trying to dodge some attack and get a little counter attack with the with the horse smash. Yeah, just kind of misplacing some aerials here. Oh, the platform just absolutely trolling. Platform's absolutely trolling. Okay. Ooh. No jump. He doesn't have a jump. Oh, no. The camera was just kind of high, and he didn't realize that uh, he wasn't going to grab a ledge. And by the time he realized, it was just a little too late. All right, so we're 2-1. So where, where do we counter pick? Uh, FD, probably what I'd say. FD, I wouldn't want to go... I wouldn't really want to go battlefield. I wouldn't want to go. I wouldn't want to go back. I wouldn't want to go to Yoshi's. We said earlier, PS2 is like a reasonable pick, but Samus does get access to a lot of missiles. You got to kind of stay on top of her to prevent her from setting up the wall. Falcon has a little more trouble than other characters, I think. Um, navigating around it in like short hop range. Of course, Falcon's fast and he can full hop and kind of cover the whole stage and call her out if she's going to do it. But. Just navigating the short hop range, kind of the safer range, is uh, not so hot. He just goes to Yoshi's. I guess this is a perfectly reasonable pick. Um, he does well with space, but uh, like here, you know, Samus can just die so early. Like if you think Samus living a long time is uh, really what's hurting you, like Yoshi's definitely helps to stop that. Because I mean, even up up air, just kind of can destroy her at really early percents. Yeah, so easy pickup on that. All right, so <laughs> navigating the projectile store com finally comes down. That was just kind of slow. You kind of she's trying to like preemptively throw out stuff. Um, it's hard to cover when he lands on a platform. Okay. Yep. <laughs> oh, Falcon kick into the nair. <laughs> you don't have to use it there. I don't know that I would have double jumped up in the zone. Probably drift away and then uh, use a double jump to try to like uh, mix up how you're going to come back lower. Oh no, he misses the uh, the wave land on. Okay. Oh, but he falls down. He gets the stomp, but he just fall. He like slides off the off the flat. <laughs> oh yeah, not much you can. It's uh, that's just rough there. If I could just on top of you, your stuff, your stuff just gets stuffed by a bear. Like Falcon doesn't have the fastest aerials if he's like on top of you, but um, Samus doesn't either really. I just basically just Nair probably is the only really think real thing she has. 
I don't know if that's up air comes out, but I mean that situation you're not using up air, so it doesn't make any sense. Okay, well, Randall, come on now, come on now. Randall's trolling. Yeah, he just decided he had to go for the gamble. I mean, yeah, if you're down, sometimes you just gotta gotta go for it. All right, good set. Good set. No more Samus in the tournament? Crazy. So many Samus sets.